Hi, my name is Monica Burns. I'm an EdTech and Curriculum Consultant, founder of ClassTechTips.com, and a webinar host for Simple K-12. I want to talk to you today about how to use an interactive number line with students, and I'm going to show off a fantastic and free tool called Numberline. Now, this is available on the web. There's also a Chrome Store app, so this makes it perfect for Chromebook classrooms, computers um, where you have or computer labs where you have access to um, desktop computers, laptops, interactive whiteboards. You can also download the Windows Store app or the Apple Store app, uh, making it great for iPad use as well. So number lines are so important for students um, to build foundational concepts and to push their thinking, whether they're using fractions like what you see on the screen or just skip counting by fives. Um, this is a wonderful tool for um, interacting with a number line. So we're going to go ahead and open up the web app so you can see it in action and right away my number line pops off the screen. If I click down here, it will let me decide if I want this to be whole numbers, maybe counting by a particular number, and it changes my number line. I could even do this with fractions, decimals, keep it open with no numbers or no ticks, or include negative numbers, um, where it'll put my zero just there at the center of the screen. So definitely up to you with how you want to do this. You can also have it so that the numbers are covered until you click on them, um, making it easier to reveal, and the ability to change the spacing. So if we made this a little narrower, we'd be able to fit more in a little wider. We want to just look for a range as well. So what this app lets you do is you can take different segments and it will help you count out, you see that 20 changes to a 30 um, as we move. So students can type in um, and add any of that annotation that they need to as well um, using this button down here. So if you're modeling for students, you might pull out this number and say, you know, what is going to go um, in this space here and have them um, work that out before you go ahead and measure it. You might pull up some of the number sentences and write a number sentence. So what I love about an app like this is that it really has to do with whatever your task is, whatever you're looking to model for your students. So if you want to use an interactive number line to help them better understand counting for negative numbers, this tool would work. If you are looking for them to explore fractional parts, um, you can go ahead and change your number line to represent that as well. So lots of options. It all depends on what you need for your students to understand, um, which students you might be differentiating for by providing different scaffolds and supports. Um, so really wonderful way for you to um, introduce students to um, counting, to operations, you name it, um, by using an interactive number line.